Hi guys, so welcome back to Junris Vlog Adag React. So for today's video reaction, let's go to one of our favorite country which is Russia. Privet and spasiba to our Russian friends. How are you all guys? If you're doing well and amazing. And the title of this video, as you can see on my thumbnail, is the largest tank class in history, the Battle of First. And credit to the owner also with the video to RT. I'll put in the description box below so that you can connect also with the owner of the video. And if you're new to my channel, just click a subscribe button. Click on notification bell so that you'll be updated on our future uploads. And if you have some comments and suggestions related to this video or any Russian video, Russian artist that you can suggest, drop a comment section. I'd love to read and respond to you all and make your video request. This is a very great information, guys, because part of the World War II history is the Battle of Kursk which is those largest tanks on that time looks at one of the key turning points of the world war ii and what this day remains the largest tank battle in the history of war uh, warfare of the battle of first uh the battle of course was a second world war engagement between the german and the soviet forces on the eastern front of the soviet union during the july august 1943 world war oh my god this is a very interesting information and the battle of course was the second world war engagement between the german and the soviet forces of the eastern front of near curse in the soviet union on july and uh the history occurred in july 1943 around the soviet city of first in western russia as germany launched an opera uh, operation citadel mm -hmm. and this was also considered last uh, July 5 to August 23, 1943. It was the German unsuccessful assault of the Soviet uh, salient around the city of course in Western Russia during the World War. Wow. Imagine guys, there are 6,000 involved in this World War tanks, 2 million troops and 4,000 aircraft. The battle began with a German surprise attack but ended but the, the German unsuccessful during on that attack to the Soviet forces. I'm so excited like to watch with this and hearing with this uh, video of how was it really happens. Imagine of, of that world war and then you will see and we will we will see also and check of how the design of this and i want you to turn on the cc down there for your russian english and whatever language that you want to choose and i want to hear also with you uh what are your additional information with regards to this the battle of course like the biggest tank battle in the world history and uh, so that i know some of you guys especially to our russian supporter that you know the history much more better than i am or to those people who make the video and I want to hear also with you at the comment section. Let's get to it, guys. Enjoy with me. Wow. Thank you so much for this one. Warplanes and helicopters have filled the skies of the Russian capital. The city is gearing up for a huge military procession on Saturday to mark the 70th anniversary of the defeat of Nazi Germany. Ah. In the run-up to the event, RT International is bringing you special coverage to commemorate the hard-fought victory. Now, today, we look at one of the key turning points of the war and what to this day remains the largest tank battle in the history of warfare. Okay, We're yeah. talking about the Battle of Kursk. So it was reminiscing the past of what would happen. Everything was in flames, locked in smoke, gas fire, so that it seemed to be danced. Wow. The largest armored class in history. I really cannot believe on these times the battle of first July to August 1940. Victory Day 7. Victory 70 days. Nazi Germany launched the offensive against the city of Kursk around 500 Kursk. kilometers southwest of Moscow in July 1943. The battle turned the tide on the Eastern Front after Soviet soldiers managed to stop the advance of Hitler's forces. RT's Neil Harvey took a closer look at this historic battle. Wow. Historical indeed, because imagine they're using those like largest July of 1943. And after suffering some major defeats, the Germans were looking to get their invasion back on track. 
So they came up with Operation Citadel, a plan to attack Soviet Operation forces Citadel. positioned near the city of Kursk. But wow. unbeknown to the Nazis, the Soviets have received warning of the attack. These are the huge tanks. With both sides moving an unprecedented number of tanks into the region. Well, this is a T-34. It was the main battle tank of the Soviet army. It was considered both versatile and effective. Oh, T-34. But that was and huge. it would play a major role in what would become the largest tank battle the world has ever seen. Wow. More than a thousand tanks took part in the slaughter, including the Germans' newly designed Panthers. But even these state-of-the-art killing machines wouldn't be enough to help the Germans against a Soviet army that knew they were coming. Oh. Advance warning had handed the Red Army the initiative, and within two months, they freed large swathes of Soviet territory. This spells the end of Hitler's dreams of dominance. From that point on, the German army oh, this was is on part the back of plan. The days of the Third Reich were numbered. Many soldiers who were defending Kursk were very young, just teenagers or in their early 20s. Oh my Many God. had just finished school, and as soon as they joined the army, were sent straight to the front line. Those who survived have been really? haunted by the memories ever since. Oh my God. I cannot imagine if Gunner joined army. Oh, this. These are the veterans. Much love and respect and salute to these guys. Oh. Still have their pictures around them. Alexei Grudinkin joined the army at the age of 18 and fought in the Battle of Kursk. Despite taking part in one of the fiercest battles of the Second World War, he says he witnessed many other horrors as well. Goodness. Командир полка на лошади догнал нас. Ребят, ускорьте шаг. Там сейчас немцы будут жечь белорусов. Ускорили шаг. Они уже с факелами. Всех загнали в сараи. Увидали нас. Бежать. И мы их, кто с автомата, кто с винтов, кто пулемета, их немцев поджигатели побили. Открыли ворота. Радость большая. And we will have more witness accounts and battle reconstructions ahead for you right here on RT International throughout the week as we mark 70 years since victory over Nazi Germany in our special coverage. Wow, that was truly an interesting like, formation given. Much love and respect and salute to all the veterans and eternal memory to all the people who involved in those wars. Oh my God, I'm so, uh, like, I was so amazed in how the Soviet Union won on that fight. Imagine of the Nazis, imagine of Hitler sent 6,000, uh, like, battle tanks on that time. The huge and the most precious battle happened in history. And... Even the Soviet Union, uh, Soviet forces won on that war. Goodness gracious, I really could not imagine to those young kids that they should be in school, but they are on those war, 17 years old, 18 years old, after they just graduated and joined forces, being part of the military. Oh my goodness. Ooh. This is truly a great history that uh, you can uh, have like respect to those people like salute and give them honor because they truly stand on their ground they truly stand and fight for their country that's to survive and the worst war ever happened in history but still this is part of the history that we always remember to those people to those heroes eternal memory to all of you guys and i really want to hear also with you what are your additional information with regards to this E epic history the battle history biggest things ever happened in the world war two that
happens between July and August 1943. And this is so interesting that we will always give respect to those people who fought for the war. Thank you so much. I hope guys you enjoyed watching with this one. And if you do, and if you really want to see the full video and connect with the owner of the video, I'll put it in the description box below. If you like this video, guys, same as I did, just give a massive thumbs up. Like and share, subscribe also with my channel. This is Junius Blagada React saying Stamble Super Safe Guys. If you want to connect my social media account, is in here. If you want to connect my second channel, it's in the description box below. Thank you so much for being and spasiba to our Russian friends. Have a good day, everyone. Bye bye. Mabuhay po tayong lahat. God bless and see you in my next video reaction.